Hi, we're Mike and Tandy from Carving Out Time. This week, we're celebrating my birthday by exploring Lookout Mountain in Chattanooga, Tennessee. We started my birthday celebration at Ruby Falls. Our son Aaron had decided to come for a visit and to hang out and explore with us. This shows just a very small portion of Leo's passage where he had to crawl through to get to discover Ruby Falls. We thought all the different formations inside the cave were really interesting. Climbing the tower, we have wonderful little Myrtle the turtle. Now Myrtle here is a little bit afraid of heights, so she has not gotten very far. She's completely petrified. <laughs> Hasn't moved a muscle, folks, honestly. All in all, I would definitely say that we enjoyed the cave tour and getting to see Ruby Falls. We were really excited to go on the Incline Railway at Lookout Mountain for part two of my birthday shenanigans. We kind of felt like once we got to the top that it had just been a ride up to a gift shop, although the view was breathtaking. Welcome aboard the Lookout Mountain Incline Railway, the world's steepest passenger railway and America's most amazing mile. The Incline Railway will travel from an altitude of 2,100 feet above sea level at a speed of 600 feet per minute straight down the face of Lookout Mountain to the Chattanooga Valley below. The grade of the track at the steepest point is 72.7%, giving the Incline Railway the unique distinction of being the steepest passenger railway in the world. The car in which you are riding was installed in March 2020, and its many windows were designed to offer a magnificent panoramic view of Lookout Mountain in all its natural splendor. The incline center rail is used by both cars going up and down the mountain. When we enter the passing switch and move past the other car going up the mountain, we are exactly at our halfway point of our downward trip. For my third birthday adventure, we went to Rock City. Y'all, I don't even know what to say. Just go. Without a lot of strenuous activity, you see some beautiful things. There is artwork within there. There's amazing views. It's just truly unbelievable. If you're near Chattanooga, take the time, make the effort, Go to Rock City. <laughs> you can definitely tell who is the most brave in this family. I don't think we could actually see seven states. There was a little bit of an overcast and I can't see that far anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna try and go this way. <laughs> you know, Yeah, you kind of have to like lean your butt out and... <laughs> <laughs> the phone barely fits through. Woo! I always have to get pictures of the waterfalls. Aaron figured he had a 50-50 chance if he ate one of those berries of getting sick. It was wonderful having our own personal photographer along with us. Don't let go, Aaron. 
Next, we have the Fairyland Caverns. We did have to wear our masks inside there because it is all inside a cavern, but the fairy tales were definitely interesting. All in all, Rock City was my favorite birthday adventure. And the grand finale was a walk across the Chattanooga Pedestrian Bridge. It was a cool evening and we even had some entertainment. We got to watch the sunset on our final night in Chattanooga. We had a great time. I really enjoyed celebrating my birthday there.